It is the little things that make a difference in life. The little things that make a difference in life. It's the little things that they all blend together. The little things is really what life is made up of. It's not these great big huge events. Even if you do have a huge event, it takes a lot of little things to make the event huge. That's true. Yeah. Yeah. How about that? Nate? And little things when you add them up become bigger things. It's I, kind of it's that's kind what of, I just said. <laughs> I was listening, really I was. <laughs> and this thing is by John Gray, who and, and is yeah, who is John Gray. John Gray is an English political philosopher and author. And has interest in the history of ideas. History oh the history, history of ideas. History of ideas. Now that I think is interesting to me. That sounds interesting to pursue that because depending on that the error in what you live in, the ideas would be different. Or are they? Well, here's, I don't know. here's something interesting because I've never heard of this history of ideas. Okay. It's uh, intellectual history. Of course. And it says <laughs> the investigative premise of intellectual history is that ideas do not develop in isolation from the thinkers who conceptualize and apply those ideas. Thus, the intellectual historian studies ideas in two contexts. <laughs> it's a little deep, right? Thus, yeah. the intellectual historian studies ideas in two contexts, such right. as abstract propositions for critical application and in concrete terms of culture, life, and history. So now I would be interested in the concrete terms of culture, life, and history. The critical application, the abstract proposition, eh, not so much. Okay, well, anyhow. That is what this uh, John Gray is in a philosopher. He's a philosopher. So, you know what? We can apply this to sewing because it's the little bitty pieces that you put together to make a big thing, like, like a tap. It takes, you know, you have to do the small hem. You take the little piece for the sleeve and you take the, see? See how that works? Right. And on the back, help someone out by doing a few chores for them. Oh, so when you get that that. <laughs> yeah. we had the same idea, didn't we? Yeah, I'm still waiting for you to help me with my sewing room. Hey, it's going to happen. Weather's getting better here in Michigan, so we are going to make that happen. And we, what our real uh, show about? Oh, I wanted to show you my cup, my chicken. Isn't that cute? I love that chicken. You know the chicken song, don't you? Mm -hmm. I don't know if they know it. Well, I had a little chicken and he wouldn't lay an egg, so I poured hot water up and down his leg. The little chicken no. screamed and the little chicken begged. The crazy old chicken laid a hard boiled egg. Dee, 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 dee. <laughs> yeah. As that was dad's song. That was my dad's song. Yeah. Dad's I cannot song. take any credit for that. <laughs> <laughs> but what we're doing today, besides yes. welcoming you and happy to have you with yes. us. Thank you. And we're looking forward always to spending our Sunday morning with you. Yes. With our cup of coffee with cafe mocha in there. And root beer with nothing in it. Which really means that it's adult chocolate <laughs> that I'm drinking. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, oh, somebody hey, else, hey, hey, somebody yeah, else wants, like wants my chocolate. So, um, yeah, a You're couple weeks ago, <laughs> for one thing, I can't believe it's March already. I'm very excited about it being March. Me too. Yes. Yeah. Moving yeah. into spring. Yes. Yay. Oh, boy, that makes my hand looks really big. Yes, look at how big her hand is tiny. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. <laughs> We're oh, being, somebody wants to drink here. your coffee yeah. here. Yeah. So, um, anyhow, Joanne's has been having uh, pattern sales. Yes, it consistently, is. like almost every weekend. Right. Really? Yeah, well, they had one last weekend. Do they? Least. Do they notify that? To you? Well, How do you find out? Because it's not always in their flyer. Yes, I just happened to have to stop there to look for something, and I'm like, oh, there's a sale on patterns, and uh -huh. then I called you. Uh -huh. No, no, no. Oh, you I stopped, stopped at, at the, the store. store. Because I needed something. At your store versus my store, who their flyer even said it was on sale. I went there. They had nothing posted that said anything was on sale. Oh. And I asked the clerk, and she said, no. She said, but you know what? We can ring it up and see. And she goes, oh, yeah, they are on sale. <laughs> I'm like, okay. <laughs> so we're going to start off first with our Sit simplicity up. haul that we did. Sit and up. I just... I just think it's I interesting think because our simplicity and the quick sew. I think the quick sew was only ninety nine, wasn't it? Yeah, the quick sew was ninety nine, but simplicity was a dollar ninety nine. So I ended up getting um, twelve patterns, and by the time we put tax and all yep. that, it would have it cost me twenty five dollars and thirty one cents. 
for the 12 patterns. But I love this. The total savings, $229.52. Oh, yeah. Well, let me see. Mine. So, that was great. Mine. Mine. Where did you find that information? <laughs> so here's what you paid, and here's your savings. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, for me, my savings, I paid $21.95. No, no. No, you paid I paid $12.93. Can you read that? Before tax. Before tax. For my patterns and the savings is one twenty five seventy six. Oh, that's kind of crooked, but yay! So Good we job. never ever. I don't think I've ever bought a pattern at full price. All right. I don't think I have either. You that's like why. Yeah, I do. If you just if you plan it out and you're patient. Yeah, I do. And here's the thing for you guys who don't have like a Joann's or a Hobby Lobby, they have online. SomethingDelightful.com or mm -hmm. Simplicity.com. Those two websites, they have sales too. They have sales, like they had a President Day sale um, at the end of February. Mm -hmm. And so they weren't a dollar ninety nine; they were three ninety nine. But they're still better than twenty four ninety five. And and you can, you know, some Doris and I, honestly, we have more patterns than we really. I'm buying patterns now just for you guys. <laughs> <laughs> we have more patterns than we really ever need. And if you're careful about how you do it and watch it, you can buy patterns that have, we've seen, five, you know, they have your slacks, yeah. they have your tops, they have your whatever pieces, and yeah. then you get, you can buy, a wardrobe. if they have a little different, a pattern that has a sleeve a little different, you can exchange them, and the pieces, you can do pattern hacking yourself, it's not that complicated, so. So she says. <laughs> well, so I'm going to show you, this is from the spring line, so I'm only going to show you the ones that I got from the new spring for simplicity. I'm going to start with 9467. 9467. Cute, cute. And what I liked was the, the option to have the sleeveless. Oh, where is it? This here, can you see? The sleeveless, number D. I thought that was really cute. At first, I wasn't going to, when I looked in the catalog, I wasn't going to get this. And then they had it in the rack. And I wasn't going to get it because I thought it was pleats, but it's not pleats. It's, it's gathered. gathered. Yeah. I, you don't, uh, yeah I'm you gonna, and pleats kind of have an issue, like me and zippers. Yeah, you'll be seeing <laughs> some of that pleat issue that I have. But, yeah. So, that's why let I got me, Let me see them. We're going to hand them to Nate. Oh, okay. What, oh, you, it looks... Oh, wow. And you know what I like on these? Look at the cuffs on those. I, yeah, isn't it cute? Oh, I really like that. And what kind of fabric does it take? Um, oh, it's all lightweight cotton lawn, charmeuse, lightweight cotton blend. Dotted Swiss? Dotted Swiss. I haven't seen that on an envelope in a while. Yeah. Silky types. Yeah. Foil. So, yeah, this is a nice, light, and airy. Yeah. Top. It's nice for spring and summer. Yeah. And then I have 9469, which is another top. Another cute little top. And this in, takes us about the same kind, silky tight, soft cottons, yeah, chambray this is long. a lot less detailed than the, the previous pattern. Yeah. But cute. Oh, it looks like I was in the top mood. <laughs> you were in the top. Oh, oh, do you like this? I like that. Yeah. This is 9470. What a cute design here for the top. Makes it a little bit beyond just the little. Yeah, and it gives you a little more shape. shape. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. And again, so. this takes the, you know, same kind of fabrics. Although it does say you can use a matte jersey or soft cotton blend. Oh, okay. And double Georgette. There's the line drawings for that one. Very nice. 9470. This one is a skirt. Can you believe it? This is 9472. 9472. So, and now that one, oh, you have your choice of yokes. One is, you got pleated. And one is gathered. One is pleated. <laughs> What was I thinking? No, I saw I saw the gathered one. <laughs> yeah. And that's the one I was interested in. And that takes cotton blends and durable, double Georgia. Yeah, nice summer skirt. Yeah, so that's the one line drawing she was talking about. Okay, then I got 9473, which is a dress with a little Oh, jacket. just a minute. Oh, sorry. Oh, and look at there's a slide slit in one view. A slide slit? <laughs> I a think it's a side. What did I say? Slide? Slide slip. <laughs> <laughs> no. Slide. So, the, and one of the views, you can barely see it, but you can see it. So, you need to pay attention to those details. There's a little slit yeah, in there. Yeah, I would not do it. Yeah, I would, why would you even need it? 
You wouldn't need it in a skirt that full. No, unless you just, it's yeah. not like you need it so you can walk. Yeah, and of course you can make them different lengths. It shows you can make them shorter or longer. So anyway, sorry. Okay, back to 9473. Yes. 9473, which is a cute dress with a little jacket. Oh, it is cute. Yeah. It is cute. And that takes cotton cute. blends and uh, crepe mm -hmm. back satin double knits. Oh Ponte. Satin, well, interesting. You can make use all kinds of different things for that. It's just the well, simple. You, yeah, you could do the dress in one fabric and then the little jacket, which I really, really like. And I, I liked the, the, the darts that come up on it. See, that's flattering to me. See, there's darts, dart lines. Yeah, it makes it more fitted and more, yeah. more tailored. Has it got darts in the back? No, I no. don't see it. Nope. Nope. But the, is the jacket? The jacket has kind of um, like a princess, princess scene. In the back. I don't know if you can see that. In the back. In the back of the jacket. Then I got dress 9475. So ready for all these pastel light colors. 9475. And... This takes brocade, chintz, cotton blends, crepes. Yeah. Jacquard. Taffeta. Jacquard. 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 <laughs> Jacquard is in the hand for the player. Okay, so. <laughs> Not the car. <laughs> <laughs> so here's the, uh, here's the uh, mm -hmm. drawings. <laughs> okay, so, and one more from this, this particular haul that I'm going to show is 9479. I thought it was a cute little pants. Pants yeah. and top. Yeah, it is. Yeah, and this takes, uh, well, um, for the um, A, which is the kind of like a tank top, Thing. That takes interlock jersey or ITY, so it does have knit. But B, C, and D, which is the other top and the pants, they take a different kind of fabric. They take cotton blends and sear sucker, sear sucker, sear sucker, double knit. Interesting. So, so is that a skirt there? Uh, the slacks and a skirt? Yes. Oh, nice. So this has slacks, skirt, and, and two, two different kinds of tops. Yeah, so there you go. You know, so that's one that would do quite yeah, a few things for you. It would, and and that's what you need to look for if you're you're limited, um, and, or maybe you just don't want a plethora of patterns. And you so. may, you guys may know this. Um, I learned this by watching other sewers with their videos. Um, so R means it's from the rack, mm -hmm. and it's a different number. So what I did because I told you it was nine four seven nine is when. All you have to do is open it up to where the instructions are, and it will tell you what the real number is. So that's a good tip. Yes. So that you don't end up buying two of the same. Not that I've ever done that. Well, I have. Times. <laughs> so that was the simplicity, huh? What did you get from simplicity? Yay! Okay. Nathan, do you want to help give these to Mama? Do you want to hand them to Mama? Mm. No, just take one out. Take one out and give it to Mama. He's like, oh, do I have to run? Hmm. He's not too energetic. To I, yeah, I don't. I think he's more. Well, it is kind of cloudy. Out. I don't know. There. Okay. Here, hang on to those. This oh, one. Look at the one he chose right off the uh, bat. Right off the bat. It's my only quick sew, and this was 99 cents. Oh, can I say something about quick sew real quick? Yeah, go ahead. I'll quickly say something about quick sew. <laughs> so quick sew is going down. I mean, they're not going to. They're not, not printing. Making, yeah. They're not making it. Anymore. Not making any patterns. So um, once you buy them up, they're gone. Yep, they'll be gone. But anyhow, sorry to interrupt you. So already. that's all right. This is Quick Sew 4353. I will say. I don't have a dog. I don't have a dog. I'm going to gift some dogs. Oh, like, what do you want a dog pattern? I have some some friends that I know that have their, their cute little. Oh, they're little doggies oh. that they love to, you know, you get them so you can spoil them and baby them. And they all wear sweaters and they all wear little. So you're going to make something. I'm going to make something for oh, isn't them. Isn't that cute? Well, I hope you um do that so that we can see it and that you take a oh, picture yeah. of the doggy in it. Oh, that would be a good idea. Have the doggy model it. That would be a good idea. Never That's a good idea. I didn't think about that. Because <laughs> I don't have a stuffed doggy or even a real doggy anymore. Yeah. Yeah. So what I was going to say. <laughs> Well, and there's different styles to this, you know, so one, it's style A has a hood, and you can see that it's got, it's, they're all quilted. I have been trying to buy a doggy pattern for several months. 
At my store, my Joann's, every time I've gone, all the doggy patterns are gone. At this Joann's, which was in a much bigger town, multiple doggy patterns were also gone. Not only from Quick Sew, but from other pattern companies. So this is the one that was there and the closest. <laughs> I'm like, okay, I'm taking I'm it. Taking it. <laughs> I'm I'll taking take that it. one. <laughs> so um, anyway, I got a doggy pattern finally. Very so, good. Yeah, so that's that. Did you want to hang on to them, bud, or no? You can put them back on the table for mom? Yeah. All right, good. Now moving on to the spring patterns. This is so cute. I it think is. this is adorable. I love the pockets on it. Oh, wow. wow. Sorry for the buzz. <laughs> Did you guys hear that? <laughs> I have it on silent, but apparently. Well, it? yeah. Ah. So anyway, Simplicity 9324. Oh, I'm just noticing the drawings of the back. This button's all the way down the back. You have one where the button's all the way down. I will change that. I'm not going to do buttons all the way down the back. I like the style of the dress. And but and one other view of the back is open in the back. Nice. With like all of the back is pretty much open in the buttons and one button. Nate is telling me to be quiet and to pay attention. <laughs> As I was distracted with my phone. Very good, Nate. You are right. You are right. I'll behave. Yeah. <laughs> So anyway, I love the way the front of that looks. It's really cute. I will be changing up the back because I'm not going to make it button all the way down the back. It's not happening. Oh, yeah. See, down the back. I don't know. How do you button You had another down? pattern that you looked at that had buttons down the back. And it's like. I put it back because I'm like, how, how am I going to do it? How do you even reach back there to do that? I mean, you know, we're maybe if you're 18 and a contortionist, you can do it. But I didn't even think I could do it then. I mean, you I would. Well, you probably. I could, but you probably couldn't. <laughs> Yeah. Anyway, this is, thank you, sweetheart. Yep. Um, this is made out of gingham, linen blends, pop, poplin, seersucker, chambray, and extra fabric is needed to match the plaids, stripes, or one-way design fabrics. Of course, all your patterns. I was going to say, all I'll mine say said that, that too. <laughs> now, this one, Dory, um, helped me to choose this one. Is this the one that buttons down the back? No. Yeah. Yes, this is the one I didn't pick up because I'm like... How do you do it? Well, I'm open. I can. <laughs> anyway, this is pattern S. It's so cute, though. you got to figure out a way to just fix it. So halfway up and put a little. Yeah, something on there. Yeah, a little button. And there's something. Uh -oh. I'll figure out something. So anyway, what, hey. sweetie? I like all the different uh, hey. versions of the neckline on this, the different collars it has on here that you can choose it to do. It is so cute. And it's a, of course, it's a vintage, 1960s huh? vintage. But I really, I really huh? like, I do like the two that are in the pictures. It's really, really sweet. Huh? Well, honey, oh, be quiet. Huh? It's my turn to talk. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, um, and this is just made out of wovens, you know, cottons, huh? linen tights, so oil silk. So here's my suggestion. You make it and figure out how to do the back so we don't have buttons. And then I'll buy one. Okay. And make one too. Because I like that. I think it's a cute pattern. Yeah, I think it'll sew up nice. Oh, I have this one. Now, this one doesn't look too summery, but no. as you all know, I've been looking for a new turtleneck pattern. I have that one. That is a little bit closer to the body. Mm -hmm. Where's Whitney? And so this one here is Simplicity 9385. And I Mama, really, Mama. Nathan, shh, shh, Mama's turn to talk, okay? I really like no. you. View D because I do not like the banded bottoms. I never have liked any, even though even when they were on trend, I just don't like the yeah. bottoms. I like them loose. So anyway, um, I like View D. It's got the cuffed sleeves and it also has View A has those the the tight cuff, you know, partially up the arm, which I do like that look. And then uh, with the bottom of the D that's not banded. So this one does take knits. So it is rib knit, stretch velvet, sweater knits, see pick a knit. Oh, oh, stretch velvet. Remember that crushed stretch velvet I got in our um, mystery box? Yes. There you go. That would be beautiful out of that. Don't you think? I do. Crushed velvet is not my cup of tea. Well, we'll see. So 
We'll see. Yeah. This is cute. Oh, and, and I have this pattern too. Yep, Dory got this pattern. Simplicity 9180. I love that one. This looks like a wonderful summer skirt. Um, it looks like there is a zipper in the back of this. No, as long as it's in the back. <laughs> yeah, I think there's a zipper. Does it say notions? Yes, an invisible zipper. I won't put an invisible one in there, but I will. Now, this reminded me, we did a uh, skirt that we had made with, it was called a pocket skirt. Mm -hmm. And I think that was in our, we'll probably put what episode it was in. <laughs> if we can <laughs> Okay. <find it. laughs> About what not to wear, because depending oh, yeah. on how you, what top you put with it, it looked nice or it didn't look nice. Yeah. But I did wear that skirt a lot. I like that skirt. So I seen this and I'm like, I'm going to make this skirt. I like that. It's a good summer skirt. Yeah. So I think that's just adorable. Uh, and these pockets kind of have the little ruffles. I like the little ruffles uh, on the skirt. So, or not on the skirt, on the pockets. The pockets. We got it. Uh, yeah. So. so did you see what kind of fabric this Oh, I didn't. I didn't. It says broad cloth, chambray, cotton tights, crepe, double knit. So a little heavier weight, not real, real thin. Of course, it's a bottom weight is what you want. Flannel, lightweight denim, linen tights, ponte, sateen. Stretch wovens, twill, and wool pipes. So I'm looking forward to making that. Yeah, That's me too. That's going to be cute. I love that. <laughs> and I like, I like this. This is different. I kind of like, did I want this or did I not want this? And I do like it. Simplicity 9046. I just, I have some, um, some, oh um. Leggings? No. <laughs> I have some leggings. I have some fabric. Let's see if it tells you in here. Like gauze like. Oh, or you're thinking for the bottom. Georgette type. Yes, for underneath there. Mm -hmm. So I thought that would be great to to color match and, and to do. I just like to look at. I might. And it has, if you look real close, I might, you can I see might. the little detail. There's buttons on the side and it's got a different little cut on that side there where it's got that little splice or slight opening. But um, I really like that. I'm going to, I hope I get that made. Hey. So I'm excited about that one too. Yeah. I don't think it'll go with that yeah. skirt, but. Oh, my. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Nathan. Oh, my. So, yes, yes. He loves Walmart. <laughs> <laughs> when he was in school, they used to take the kids' class to Walmart. And so from little, he's. Likes Walmart. He likes Walmart. Everything's Walmart. Everything's Walmart. <laughs> so, okay, this pattern, 8641. Uh -uh. I'm like, I really like that. I wish it was a dress. I saw that. And I'm like, oh, I would like that as a dress. It's a jumper. No. Look at it. It's an apron. Yeah, but it's a jumper type thing that you wear. Jumper. Mrs. Jumper. <laughs> with bodice and skirt and length variations. So it's a jumper. It's not open anywhere. Oh. It's not like an apron that you, 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 well, there's, there's no one's going on my list then. opening anywhere. I, like I saw that and I said, oh, it's an apron. It would be really cute, but it's an apron. Why does it say in there Sew House 7 sewing pattern? Because that's the, the designer. designer. But anyway, I love, see, look at the back of that. Can you not see that in a nice no. summer? Like they have it in some just plain designs, but with a t-shirt like she's wearing. Yeah. I mean, that is so cool. I, I really like that. Nice pair of sandals. Yeah, that's nice. Toe ring on your toe. Woo! Ankle bracelet. Yeah, that would be cool, too. All right. <laughs> so, okay, but I like that. I, I got All several right, patterns right. here I really, really like. Now, this one I did not get. Are we changing from Simplicity Hall now to our other hall? Well, this is, <laughs> this is a hall that I went to my store. I didn't leave town. I had like six or seven patterns laid out that I wanted to get. Yeah. The only one they had. So this was a Vogue. And in fact, I don't even think this one I had written out. But this was oh, for, cute. I don't know, was it on sale for $4.99 or $5.99? Five bucks, oh, yeah. something like that. I love the variations of the sleeve. And I particularly like Guys. this one. I love, see how that sleeve bounces is flowy it's what would you call it's that it's really cute it's kind of full it's just a full sleeve i just like sorry did i ah! she got me. Oh. <laughs> but anyway it's, it's supposed to be an easy vogue these are the line line drawings of that. Hey. there's quite a bit of variation you can do with that hey and if anybody ever knew what question what this is that shows you the body type 
that their pat that this particular pattern is good for. Yeah, Vogue does that. shape. Mm -hmm. I really like that. Not that hey. I pay much attention to it, but I like that. So we'll see. And is this lined, very loose fitting online jacket in various lengths? Uh, crepe, wool, flannel, gabardine, hey. linen, lens. Oh, that's it. That is it. Yeah. Oh, and I like it because it, oh, I had to get a 14. Oh, I hope it's going to be all right. No. Well, Never know. You know, I go according to the measurements. And hey. sometimes, sometimes it's right and sometimes it's yeah. not. Yeah, so we'll see. So I, during that sale, I went to my Her store, store yeah. which had, I'm going to move my bags here. Okay. Um, go I have, I got three Vogue patterns. I got Vogue 1733, which is just, um, and yeah. So I was thinking, well, is that, can you really use it for spring? But look at this. You oh, see, see, see sleeveless. sleeveless. Which Yay. You, which you don't, oh yeah, you do see it here. She must have something over it. Cause I was like, you don't see it, but see, she has a shirt, uh, not over it, under it. <laughs> yeah. Sheesh. It's kind of deceiving, but yeah, that's a Marcy Tilton. I like Marcy Tilton. You do. I do. And then here is one nine zero zero six. Nice summer top. Mm -hmm. I think. Yes. And, um, hey, does, I like the neckline on that. It doesn't. Say what um, fabrics to use with. Oh, there it is. It I'm does. Sure, it does. I'm like, wow, it doesn't tell me. I just guess. Yeah. Hmm. Crepe de chine. Crepe de chine. Crepe de chine. Okay, and then one other one is. Um, but I do like the neckline on that. that. That's really pretty how that drapes. Yeah. I like that. 8817. Now, does anybody know is Catherine Tilton related to Marcy Tilton? Are they sisters? <gasps> We should look that up. We need to look that up. Just I I just like their artistic. They kind of artsy. Yeah, think, they are. I think. Yes. You know. And the fact that you can use different fabrics together, mm -hmm. you know. Yeah. So that was those three. And then I oh, and then I got Butterwick at the same time because those were on sale. So these were a dollar So this is a couple of pattern hauls here. Yeah. There's the there's end. actually three. Because we did the Simplicity one. Then I did the Vogue and Butterwick one. The Simplicity one, the first ones, was the spring catalog. Yeah. Right. Right. So this is just the Butterwick. Um, it's a cute little um, kind of sweatpants. That's kind of, I've been looking for sweatpants. No, 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 no. I go swimming. Mm. And when it, <laughs> Nate likes it. And when there I go swimming, I, I like to just I throw know. on, you know, like jogging pants to, mm -hmm. to come home in. And then I change. So That's nice. That these are, oh yeah, and they're made for like French cherry sweatshirt fleece. So that's exactly what these yeah, are. Yeah, they're just sweatpants. Yeah, sweatpants. 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 And then 6861 was a cute jumpsuit. And it's also for moderate stretch knits. Again, French cherry sweatshirt fleece. Yeah, and jumpsuit. these are all called active wear, actually. We're using kind of an old term. Active wear, I'm sorry. <laughs> and then. Oh, Dory. I have that pattern. Oh, oh! You should have consulted me before you bought that. Why have you made it? I will not make it. Oh, this is six eight two nine. You My know why? My sister is saying, "Do not buy it." Well, for me and maybe for you guys, it's going to be fine. That neckline is all pleats, all the way around pleats? the front and the back. I need a lesson in pleats. You'll have to give me a lesson in pleats. It's all pleated, and I thought it was gathered. And maybe it's we could not. gather it. Maybe we could modify it. That would be a fun modify. It's it's beautiful how it's all, you know. And and I if you look know. at it close enough, I guess you can tell. I focused in on the pattern. The pattern that the model was wearing, the pattern fabric. I think Nathan, that's what I did please. too. <laughs> Thank you, Mom. And so I love it. I love the way it looks, but Thank I pulled Mom. it out to make it. And I went, not doing that. Not doing that. Thank you, Mom. Okay. Uh, are you sure they're pleats? Uh, I can, yeah, they're pleats. Nathan, it should say on here, pleated top. Oh. That's a hint, Butterwick. If it's going to be pleated, say it. Say it. So we don't have to Thank guess. You. And this one, this one has um, the dress in different cup sizes. Oh, that's nice. So I thought that would be nice for me. Um, this is B6759. Well, I think it's nice for anybody. 
Only for me. <laughs> Nobody else gets to do it. <laughs> it's just a cute dress. It is cute. And look at that. You would think that's a skirt and top. You would think that's a skirt and top. Oh, it's it's continuous together. Oh, yeah. that is cute how it's, they did that. And yeah, it's really cute. Look at and the you can really do that with any pattern that has a yoke on it like that. Yeah. Why not? The trick is to figure out the yardage in it. Yeah. You know. Then the last three patterns I got was from, uh, we have a store that's only local in Michigan, and it's called Fields Fabrics. And they had their new looks on sale. So again, these are not spring patterns, but they were just patterns that I thought would, oh, one of them might be spring. Anyway, <laughs> 6582. <laughs> I don't know if anybody has that or has made that. Just a top and pants. Easy. Really. I kind of like, I do like new look patterns, to tell you the truth. Yeah, 6618, what a cute dress. I have, have we made too many? Have we made new looks? I have made new looks. I don't know if I've made any new I've looks. made quite a few. And I <laughs> love this because I've been looking Maybe for just a cute, simple, simple. Is it an apron or is it a jumper? <laughs> <laughs> it is called um, Mrs. <laughs> <laughs> it is called a Mrs. It doesn't say what it's called, but it do, it is a jumper in in yeah, America. America, we call it jumper. Yeah, I think they call them pin pinnacles. I don't know. I haven't watched. Okay, all you people from other countries, tell us what you call them. But very simple, and I've been wanting one, so I got it. Do you like the square neck or the V-neck? It's got different It does uh, have, have different neck styles. I think the square is cute, but it also has the V, yeah, just those two. Mm -hmm. Yes, but I think it's cute, and it's got pockets. How cute is that? Or you can do it without pockets and mm -hmm. But Anyway, there we go. Woo! That is Boy. our pattern, huh? It's a long one. Hey. Yep, there's lots of patterns in it. Hopefully you enjoyed looking at them with us. Yeah. You enjoy. Hope you wrote some down. Yes. That you might want that for you yourself. Might want. And we'll be making some of these. Yeah, we will. Yes, we will. That'll yes. be, they'll be coming up. Because it's the little things that make a difference in life. So, so it's just sharing uh. our patterns with you. Yeah. How about that? Uh -huh. All right. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, hit like, forward, and um, you can hit the notification button. Did I say comment? I don't oh, know. Oh, comment. comment. Yes, be sure to comment. We enjoy your <laughs> We comments. don't even know what we're saying anymore. So long. <laughs> All right, we'll see you next Sunday. All right. Bye-bye. Have a great week, everybody.